Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing how I installed this wig. I also colored it a wine red color. I'm also going to show you how I achieved that and what I used. And right now I'm just showing you the wig, what it came with and what it looks like before. And this is what it looks like after. If you want to see how I achieved these results, please stay tuned. This is the brand of hair color that I used and you literally just follow the numbers. It comes with one, two, three, and four steps. You're just gonna read the instructions, mix them together, shake them up, and just put it on the hair. I'm spraying the Gots to Be spray on it and blow drying it just to create a barrier so the color won't get on the lace. And you're just gonna saturate the hair completely and let it sit for 25 minutes. We did this red wine color um, it's not like on camera, it's not showing up as bright as it really is, but it's pretty, it's pretty, you know, wine-ish. If you are on a budget and you don't know much about putting on wigs, this is for you. I'm just going to do a real short curly bob. So if you want to see this look, stay tuned. This is honestly one of the easiest wigs I have put on. The wig came with the elastic band attached. You're just gonna follow the steps of putting the correct makeup color on the lace. Now we're going to proceed with cutting the lace off of the wig. Once you've cut the lace off of the wig, you're gonna just take out some small little hairs that are gonna be your baby hairs. Once you've gotten the correct amount out that you want, this doesn't have to be perfect, you're just gonna grab some scissors or a razor and cut them short, as you see me doing. You're gonna lay your baby hairs down with some Gots to Be gel. And laying your baby hairs down, you can just play around with them until you get them exactly how you want them to look. This wig fits very snug. I do not have to add any Gots to Be gel or the spray around the whole front of the wig because the band allows the wig to lay down pretty flat. And I want the wig to be shorter than it already is. So I'm just gonna go around the whole wig and cut the little straggly hair so it can be an even blunt cut. Continue to cut until you get the results that you want. And this is honestly the end of the video. This wig was so easy to put on. And I hope you guys follow these steps. And you'll be slaying in the wig game in no time. Thank you guys for tuning in. Love you so much. See you on my next video. The details for this exact wig will be in my description box.